skateboarder. Zoom, zoom. Yeah, zoom, zoom. me too. Yeah. Thanks, Inertia. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Zoom, zoom. zoom, zoom. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, Sid, what? it's time for our play date. All right, I can't wait. We're gonna play and then have a snack and then play some more. It's gonna be great. Yeah. Okay, my skateboarding scientist, time to go home. Follow Yay. me. <laughs> and there's Gabriella. Hi. Hello. Here we go, kids. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> ah. That's right in with Grandma. <laughs> so, kiddos, tell me about your day. Oh, it was great. Mm -hmm. This morning, Ignatz was riding on my skateboard and it hit a bench. Bam! Whoa! <laughs> yeah, Ignatz kept on moving even though the skateboard was stopped. And that's called inertia. Wow, that's mm -hmm. a big word. Inertia. Yeah. Mm. Oh, oh, and at school, we got to ride in a wagon that Susie pulled. And when the wagon stopped, we got to feel inertia. Feel mm. it, huh? Whoa, what a great way to learn about inertia. Oh, hey, here's something. Did you know that inertia is the very reason we use seat belts today? Really? Yes. A long time ago, cars didn't have seat belts. It's true. So if a car bumped into something, the passengers could still move forward, and that's not safe. The first car I ever rode in didn't have seat belts for kids or adults. When I was a little older, cars got seat belts that just went across your lap. Then newer cars were made and that had seat belts that also went across your chest, just like I'm wearing and you're wearing right now. Yup, today's cars have seat belts and car seats to stop our inertia in case we bump into something. So we're always as safe as can be when we drive. Let's hear it for seat belts! Yay! <laughs> Yay! Wow, Grandma. So that's why we wear seat belts to keep us safe. Oh, you betcha! Mm -hmm. Wow, Sid, your grandma knows everything. <laughs> yes, she does. I have the smartest, best grandma in the whole world. Watch more on your local PBS station and the PBS Kids video app.